how many marks actually in uh, gate examinations will be asked uh, what are the titles are more important so is there uh, any possibility to avoid mathematics in which they can study gate exams so those are going for gate examinations for preparing engineering mathematics point of view so what is the suggestion you can the students who are preparing engineering mathematics what kind of books can able to prepare it so previous year question paper how it will helps you to get good marks yes, sir hello sir uh, so today we are going to discuss about engineering mathematics in gate exams so how many marks actually in uh, gate examinations will be asked uh, engineering marks subject has a weightage of 13 so engineering mathematics in gate examination is about uh, 13 marks 13 marks so yes, it is common for everyone or maybe in paper to paper will vary no no it depends on the different branches okay so computer science has a less weightage it's around like 4 marks or 5 marks but for other branches it's for 13 marks okay so computer science so what other other title will be contributed in this maths? in computer uh, in computer science they have a special subject for them only which is known as discrete maths okay so we used so, to call uh, discrete maths discrete maths yeah so it's a combined actually they have also 13 marks the only thing is it's combined with discrete maths. okay so when you are going for examination is there any separate uh, uh section will be given for uh, mathematics or maybe in uh, mingled with uh, no no it's mingled with the course subject okay. itself so it's the structure is 15 marks for aptitude and okay. rest 85 marks for mathematics and course subject okay. we can we predict uh, is there a, a one mark questions or maybe two mark questions in gate examinations in mathematics it side? can vary generally what we normally say is let's say you have four two mark questions So the rest will be one mark questions. Okay, so uh, in our one mark, so four one mark, two mark questions, and remaining five will be one mark. Okay. It can vary slightly from there also. So how many topics the students need to concentrate in engineering mathematics? Excluding computer science, you actually need to focus on seven topics. So the topics are calculus. With calculus, you also consider vector calculus. Then uh, differential equations, complex variables, uh, linear algebra, probability, uh, transform theory, and numerical methods. uh what are the titles are more important the most important there are three titles okay so that is linear algebra calculus and probability okay so the students uh, if they are studying these three titles these three how, titles how many marks can able to score uh, maximum 9 minimum at least 7 okay maximum 9 minimum 7 yes, so is there any possibility to avoid mathematics in which if they can study gate exams uh, uh, the problem is it will be a difficult task the reason is you are going to score in maths okay because maths i quite easy compared to other uh, the only uh, see if you take a core subject let's say if you remove 13 marks out of the core subject so 85 minus 13 is what uh, 72 so you have to study for the 72 so that is a very vast syllabus compared to the maths okay maths is actually a smaller syllabus let's scoring wise is also maths is quite easy problems so uh, what subjects can able to uh, you know begin with the mathematics well, what subjects can we easily they can understand see the main three topics that i discussed is let's start with linear algebra that is your basic matrices and determinants so you can start from your basics from there and then go on building up the concepts like rank the solution of equations eigen value eigen vector so like that you can build it up so is there any uh, higher secondary level mathematics and uh, yeah, this higher one? secondary mathematics okay. okay so those are prepared the main three subjects that i told you uh, probability uh, calculus and uh, linear algebra there almost one third to at least one fourth of the portion is 11th and 12th itself okay so students who prepared already 11th 12th no, mainly they will prepared already yeah. so those are prepared already in objective point of view or in uh, mathematics okay. in uh, high secondary they level will find it easy. they can easily and are ready so and also those are prepared for iit je exams also possibly they, find they can uh, find, it, find it very easy very easily they can able to score so, you told there are many topics in gate examinations the linear calculus differential complex so is there any weightage or prescribed weightage this is what will be asked in uh, upcoming examinations yes, as i said the the main topic that i need to focus is linear algebra probability and statistics uh, sorry linear algebra probability and uh, calculus uh, calculus yes so that is going to be the highest weight so let, let us assume that there is a 7 to 9 marks for that remaining topics the, that is 4 marks to 6 uh, marks 6 marks will be asked from the remaining topics okay but individual topic wise it's quite difficult to divide okay so because what happens is the how they visualize that based on the paper every year set so we cannot uh, split it up okay mm-hmm. those are going for gate examinations for preparing engineering mathematics point of view so what is the suggestion you can able to give so the suggestion that i recommend is um, let's say you're if you're good in maths you can start with the uh, let's say the basic three topics and then jump to the higher topics also okay differential equations uh, complex uh, complex functions 
and uh, numerical methods and all those things. Now, for people who are very poor in maths, that's what I mostly generally see with engineering students. So, if you are very poor in maths, the topics that I said earlier, start with your NCRT books. Okay. Let us start with the basics. Uh, take the easiest topic. The easiest topic of all, of all is metrics. Start from the NCRT books. Okay. Start from there. Prepare it for some time and then jump to the engineering topics. Okay. Because once you are comfortable with the uh, metrics, then the engineering topics becomes very easy. Okay. Same thing goes for calculus. Study the basic limits, differentiation, integration. Although it will consume a lot of time, that is almost a 60% weightage of that. Okay. Because most of the problems are there, then other problems also come, like multiple integrals and all those things. Uh, actually, my question is uh, that one only. Uh, it is uh, the students who are preparing engineering mathematics. What kind of books can I able to prepare it? So, okay, if you are poor, start with NCRT. NCRT. So, uh, students NCRT or state syllabus. State both syllabus. are kind of same. Yes. So, any one syllabus, you select that book, start from there. St uh, then uh, learn the complex formulas inside that also. There are some tough problems inside that also. Just learn that, understand the concepts, and then jump to the gate problems. Okay. So, previous year question paper, how it helps you to get good marks? Questions are never repeated in gate. Okay. But the type of questions are always repeated. That's what I always say. So, the same focus on the type of problem that they are asking. So, mainly focus on the last 15 years. Last 15 years. 15, 15, 1, 5. So, 15 years mainly focus there. And from there, okay. you learn what type of persons are asked. And you can uh, do a reverse study of that also. Okay. Okay. Mainly, uh, you told a linear calculus and then probability. So there are three titles, right? Yes, sir. So, in this, uh, each and every title, is there any subtitle in which definitely we will get some questions? Uh, linear algebra, higher probability. I am not saying definitely, but okay. higher probability is for eigenvalue eigenvector. Okay. In calculus, higher probability is for multiple integrals or... Uh, your uh, application of derivatives. Okay. They both are having equal weightage. Whereas in uh, probability, basic probability and condition probability, those times can be asked a lot. Okay. They are asked a lot, lot in the cases. And binomial distribution. Mm -hmm. These are the three topics that are mainly focused. So there is a high probability in asking those questions. Okay. Discussion with Juno sir. Uh, um, gate mathematics is very important as well as scoring and boosting your total marks. So in case without max, if you are going and then if you are losing uh, 8 to 10 marks, definitely you will lose uh, 1000 to 2000 all India rank probably. So possibly you can start preparing max without max if there is no engineering subjects will not be able to complete. Maybe this engineering mathematics solving probably it will come into your technical as well. So that preparing engineering mathematics definitely will, will help you for your career also. So definitely 10 marks will give you leading of uh, uh, getting into the good rank also. So students don't avoid it and try to prepare at least linear calculus and probability these titles and then once completed probably you can go for other title also. So wish you all the best. Thank you. Thank you sir. Thank you.